mean, as a new perspective, I think that's a magnificent idea of your government. And if only more nations would think in the same manner, the world would be a better place. There's so much oil underneath the soil uh, that it's going to be very difficult for any country to resist the profits in the short term that exist there. Uh, but uh, the Ecuadorian people must understand that the value, even in monetary terms, even with money, in, in money value, is so much greater uh, for preserving the Yasuni than it is for exploiting it now. We scientists who attended this summit uh, have promised to do our best to call the attention of the world via articles in the prominent scientific journals, editorials, etc., in the next few weeks to call attention to the need here and get more countries and foundations and people to make donations to Ecuador to make this possible to save Yasuni. We should try, if we can, to preserve the Yasuni for the benefit of our children and the children of our children, because this is a resource which will forever, can forever beautify our lives and can bring new medicines, new opportunities in ecotourism, pure beauty to everybody in the world. Ecuador is at a decision point uh, that will affect its future, its people and its environment. And I think it would be very wise and a lesson for the world, a light to the world, if it could base, uh, continue to base its economy on something else other than oil. It has so much that can give it riches in the future.